take me away from all this? Okay, how about this? Ew! Why'd you take me to the alleyway? Alright, oops, 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 oops. Brr! It's so cold! Oh! It's so dry! Now we're talking. This is getting better. What? Back to the office. You're so mean. Ah, duck, duck, heaven. Alrighty then. Okay, in today's lesson, we are going to remove the background or turn the background into a transparency and just bring out our object our lady in a dress okay so we are going to use windows or microsoft's paint 3d which is a free software that comes with windows windows 10 all the new windows has this i believe or it can be downloaded for free Welcome to SharingYourPassion.com. I am Chill and my goal is to help people create an online business which can also be called digital or online marketing. To do so, I'll be teaching you how to create your own website using WordPress, do email automation, make online courses, add membership access, earn through affiliate marketing, and lots more. Subscribe and hit the notification bell if you are interested in any or all of these. Thank you. So let's start with the original file. You would just right click that file and edit with Paint 3D. I, I already have it opened here. So this is one of the easiest tools to remove a background. You just click on this cool magic select tool. And you don't have to bother cropping this time because this, the background is solid. So um, if you have a lot of things going on, then you might want to crop it down, dragging these uh, points down. Like it's showing you in the sample here. But let's just click next. Boom. It just took out the background. And we don't have to do any adjustments here. If you wanted to do some adjustments, it, if it took out too much or included taking out her hair, you could add it by clicking this and touching her hair or to remove things you can click on the eraser and just touch the er, the object that you want erased okay but we're done here okay so now she's like what they call a sticker in this program she's a sticker now you can just drag her around and paste her if you wanted to just set her there or there so if you wanted to turn this image into a transparent background image, you would select that remaining background, click on the delete button, bring her back over, go to menu, save as, save as image okay if you save it as a JPEG this transparency box is grayed out it's not an option so you can't do it with the JPEG but if you save it as a PNG yes you can click on transparency for the background and there you go it's the checkered ba background means that won't show up we can save that call it lady with transparent background as a PNG okay let's check our files here this is the new PNG file and look it's totally black 
what will show up is just her and you can um, take this into any graphic editor and you can superimpose her on any background and, I, and that's what I did earlier in the beginning of the video I superimposed her on various backgrounds okay the other thing is what if what if there was more noise in the background it'll be a, a little bit trickier so let's um, let's close this and start a new <clears throat> project okay this time we're going to work with a background that has a little bit more noise oh, edit with paint 3d okay so here I earlier typed in you know get rid of this background and let's see how the magic select tool works now okay remember we didn't adjust the cropping so let's see how it deals with this so look it got rid of the fonts or the typing but it left this area of of uh, the blue background so now it, let's click on remove let's zoom in control wheel in and let's remove this by just drawing lines on what you want to remove done that took care of that part okay so now we can do the same thing click done and go through that same process of selecting this background and deleting it and you know how to save it as we did earlier okay so that's how we remove a background using paint 3d thanks for watching I hope you found this useful and if so, please give the video a like and even share it with others who you know will find it useful. Let me know down on the comments section below if you have other questions I haven't addressed and I'll certainly get back to you as soon as I can. To get more information on how to use great productivity tools and ideas, you can pause the video and check the description section below. To stay updated with new valuable lessons and to join me in this quest on how to make money online, subscribe and click the notification bell. And remember, it's my mission to give you the tools and inspiration to believe in yourself, to dream big, and transform your passion into success. Thank you.